So I've had a problem with a lot of my videos recently where the audio um, doesn't stay in sync for the whole duration of the video. Um, I'll sync it up at the beginning and then when I get to the end it won't have been uh, it won't be sync sunk up still. Sorry. So I headed over to the Apple discussion forums, um, which is a great place. If you've got any problems with Final Cut, um, whatever version you got, just go to their uh, discussion forum and users who are who know what they're talking about will uh, be able to help. So I went and I started one and I asked what was wrong and I got pointed to this piece of software here by a company called Squared5, uh, squared5.com. It's a program called MPEG Stream Clip. And I've been using it before to convert my uh, video files from uh, MP4 format to an Apple Intermediate Codec and MOV so I can edit it with Final Cut. Um, so that's what I did. I downloaded the software. It's free. So what I'll do... Um, open it up here. And this meant that I could convert um, all my audio into the right, uh, well not exactly format, it recorded in 44.1 uh, kilobits per second and you needed it into 48 kilobits per second which matched up with not only the video files audio but also the audio in the Final Cut project. So first I'll show you, you can do it with video, so what I'll do is I'll, I've got a finder window open here. This is a review I was doing, which will be coming up soon. And this has already been converted, but I can show you anyway. I'll open it with MPEG Stream Clip, and it opens up here. And you can scrub through, you can set your in and out points, but we'll leave it like this. And export, and you've got all these different formats, and I'll go export to QuickTime. And I've made some presets, set it to Apple Intermediate Codec, which is what I edit with in Final Cut, 100% quality, uncompressed stereo at 48 kilohertz, 30 frames per second, 12A uh, by 720 HDTV, 720p, and then you just hit make movie, and you'll save it as whatever you want. But, I won't, I've already done that, so what you can also do is I'll open files, oops, open your eye is I'll open files and I will go to tech stop TV and I'll go to product reviews and what I'll do is I'll go to audio files and from here I can select the main VO which is the audio recorded from Blue Snowball into GarageBand um, This, if this comes up just hit open anyway I'll open up the audio here. What you can do is you hit file, export audio, and this is where you want the sample rate and you want to change the sample rate to 48 kilohertz. Hit OK and save it out to whatever you want it to be. And I won't do that right now. Once you do that, if you bring that into Final Cut, you should then be able to sync it up and it should work absolutely fine. Um, if you've got any problems, you can either leave a comment below or, as I said earlier, I'd suggest go to the Apple discussion forums. Now this is if you have any problem whatsoever. Um, also, what you want to do is you want to make a quick search first and search. Maybe someone's already answered a question that someone else had the same problem as you. Um, save making another uh, topic. Just search there. Um, you can use your Apple ID to sign in. Uh, just post a new topic by clicking up there. Um, pretty simple. Not much to it. So that's a look at MPEG Stream Clip from a company called Squared5. Thanks for watching this video from TechStop TV. Check out our other videos at youtubes.com forward slash TechStop TV.